This video contains a video of some parts of the Canmore Challenge Canadian Mountain Running Championships to take place June 13th. And so we only have portions of the route. The portions of the route that we have video for are the upper portions at the very top end and also the entire lower loop. And that will follow in the video. And the start and finish are in the stadium and the route starts up. Here we have the course profile of the three loops of the 12k the Canadian Mountain Running Championships and uh, each loop the elevation gain uh, the total gain is about 200 meters the top to bottom vertical is about 170 to 180 meters so the pen points at the start and finish line and then the route is moderately up through this section and then as it comes onto the down leg of the Olympic loop here there's a small drop and then there's a considerable climb heading up to the high point and this climbs up to the high point here about a hundred meters vertical okay we're looking at the start area the route goes up this ramp beside the the fence and then it makes a quick right up to where that post is basically and then another left up that long path up that path there and it'll go over the top here you can't quite see it any longer but, but it's up there in the trees you can see the path it'll come down a bit and then over in those trees it's going to head straight up the hill but uh, I can't see it right now and I'm not going to be able to come down again to video and uh, make this left turn onto the little loop up here that gives us the maximum elevation hey. there's a little dip here and uh, Bit of a steep part. We head up towards the top of the trail, and that little rise there is the high point. And uh, this is the high point. Some wildlife. And there's an intersection with um, one of the main trails and the skiing. So we're going to go straight across it. The last video ended here, but the next video you will see is coming out of the biathlon stadium here on the flat and heading into the trees. And then you'll see the complete loop heading around the lower loop and coming back up through the biathlon area. And it will stop on this ramp coming up to the finish line. And the route comes out of the, beside the biathlon stadium runs along the dirt beside the roller ski trail and it's going to make a fairly tight turn there'll be a bit of pavement here then it's going to be a tight turn as it goes around to head down into the woods you can see the woods down there and make a turn around here and then down onto this road here in fact the up will be parallel to this at this point but the path the, the route takes the path here and down into the trees there. And the path goes down here, coming into the woods, and it follows the dirt into the trees here. Straight down there. We've just ended the trees. There is an option to take the bridge on the right, but probably in the race we'll come down beside the bridge and uh, down into this into this trail here and uh, off through the trees here. 
and we've just gone over the bridge another 100 meters and another 100 meters and here's a little bit of a climb Hey, okay, trail goes along the path there Hey, okay, trail goes right down along this path okay the route goes along the trail at the bottom there and then across the dam here beside the pond and then it follows the trail in the woods there trail takes the right turn or, or actually goes straight on do not take the left fork okay there's a bit of a tight turn going to the right and along this old uh, waterway a little bit of flat before the main climb starts and this is the bottom point of the of the course Okay, we've come along the canal, a little flat bit. Turn left over the dam. Trail's gonna... A little pond on our right. And, uh... Trail's gonna go up the hill. Okay, so we're just above the pond. And we've got some... pretty tough single track here. Trail goes up around this corner. This is on the top of the corner. And this is a mountain bike route, and it's uh, it's pretty tough. Might as well video the whole thing here. Truck comes up the hill, and uh, makes a big right turn here. And that's a pretty tough little section, but it uh, <coughs> tops out. Got a nice open. This will be marked with pylons. So. Yeah, you might want to say bear bone. Yeah, bear. Yeah. <coughs> and uh, a little bit of a down section. Here we go back onto the the. Uh, Nordic Center ski trails. There's a bit of flat here before we make a, another big climb. Bit of a drop here. And a long gentle climb back up towards the start line. Okay, we're back up near the start line. We will go down the hill here. There's a bit of a ditch. If people shortcut, they're going to be uh, finding some trouble. It's hidden behind the ridge. The trail's going to go up towards the building there. Okay, we're up beside the building. We're going to come up to this fence and make a sharp left at the fence. It's okay. So the path comes up onto the, into the bathroom area. Let's turn here. For some people they might go on the pavement, but uh, the actual trail will be marked on the, on the dirt here. Okay, through the tunnel. Gonna cut off, not on the trail, I mean not on the pavement. Gonna make the turn, coming around. And we're basically gonna be heading straight up towards uh, Mount Lawrence Grassy here. Okay, so this is basically the finish of the race. Be coming up on the, on this uh, ramp here. And uh, you make a right turn into the middle of the, the middle of this stadium area. And uh, so the, Finish will be basically right there in the open, probably. I mean, we'll see on the day where it has to be. And 